Hi everybody, my name is Nganawe Kobulun Kose Shangase, also known as Nganawe Live, and this is Tagged. So 2020 has been a very difficult and torturous year, a very sad year at that, but we have to do whatever we can to try and stay emotionally afloat, try and keep ourselves happy and uh, joyous to some degree since this is such a very crushing year. And one thing you guys might not know about me is that I'm actually a huge fan of comedy, specifically stand-up comedy at that. And so um, I watch a lot of stand-up comedy, a lot of international stand-up comedy, but also local stand-up comedy. And that is exactly what I'm here to talk about today. And part of the reason why I'm even doing this video is because as much as South Africans are a pretty funny country and do love comedy what I've noticed is that there's not much focus on South African comedy you know South African comedians and um, we have some pretty talented comedians in South Africa but and that end up being overlooked and so I created a list I've been watching a lot of stand-up comedy on Showmax so I just created a list that's gonna have like you know roughly five to seven titles of some stand-up comedy content that you can watch from the comfort of your home currently streaming right now on showmax now there are a lot of local stand-up comedy titles on showmax i'm obviously not gonna go through all of them so i just picked the ones that i happen to enjoy the most for a variety of reasons some i really really thought like this was good but some just the overall watching experience no matter how i felt about the actual stand-up itself the overall watch experience was uh, pretty enjoyable with that being said let's get into it so first on the list is comedy central presents david gao live at, at parker's this one is a special that is headlined by david gao but then there are some opening acts that open up before him prior to that one of them being uskumba and the other one being dave levison who are you know fairly funny comedians dave levison being you know somewhat of a veteran even within the industry it ends off with david gao delivering some pretty short it's pretty short that's what i like about these these these, these suggestions that i'm giving you they're pretty short and you can get through them pretty quickly and it ends off with david gao you know uh delivering somewhat of a pretty pretty good act second on the list is still comedy central presents goliath and goliath live at parkers and as you can already guess this one is just the goliath are they called the goliath brothers i don't know i don't know whether they're actually brothers whether they're related or they're just friends and they're just i don't know but it's you know you guys know them uh donovan goliath nicholas goliath and jonathan goliath headlining and then next on the list is the live series a white christmas 2 this was a stand-up special a christmas themed stand-up special the second of its kind i never really watched the first one i just watched the second one um i don't think that's really a big problem since i don't think it's like there's any continuity but four stand-up comedians who are part of this special first one being glenn bitterman pam the second one being one of my favorite comedians robbie collins third being again one of my favorite comedians mo jagli hoko lastly headlining that special was skelk besaden hold who also is one of my favorite stand-up comedians, but also one of my favorite South African actors in general. Next on the list is, you guys might actually be familiar with this one, Nation Wild presented by Trevor Noah. And this is a stand-up special series where Trevor Noah was, I wanna say, giving back to the comedy community by highlighting uh, up and coming and unnoticed uh, com comedic acts. It's it's 13 episodes. It's a lot of it's a lot of comedians that are featured on there, uh, and it goes sort of like so the first half of the episode will profile the comedian, who they are, where they come from, and then the next half of the, the episode will then have the comedians actually performing. And um, that's where I actually came across someone who is now one of my favorite comedians, which I'm about to mention next, and that is Titi Chumia. I hope I'm saying surname correctly Chomia and speaking of Dizzy Chomia uh, he also has a special that he released last year if I'm not mistaken called So Naive I'd, I'd suggest you watch Nature Noir first see him there and then go watch his stand-up special uh, where you see him do his own thing there and that is another recommendation on the list that I really enjoyed So Naive by Dizzy Chomia next on the list now this one uh, is a bit I don't want to say hard to watch it's not really hard to watch it's very good it's very funny but because of just the nature of the format of it, it's very difficult even for the comedians to pull off. So there are some pretty hard, second embarrassment, cringy moments because you get to watch comedians bomb like 
there you know seeing a comedian you know do horribly because we usually don't see that comedians go on they put out their material they practice and they get better and they bomb not in front of our eyes and then by the time they feel like okay they got it then they'll come and you know record or do a, a special but this one just by the mere nature this is comedy central uh presents the rose battle the south african version not the american version uh hosted by john flismas and uh yeah this one it's pretty fun it's pretty funny it's nice to watch but it also has a lot of tough moments to actually get through because you get to see comedians just do horribly like you're like oh my god i know you're good but oh this is painful to watch but i guess there's something in that i don't know what it's called i think there's a german word for that i forgot it but yeah uh comedy central presents the roast battle uh, South African, the South African version. And last on the list, last but not least, this is Funny People Africa. And this is a Pan-African comedy special series or other comedy stand-up special series that goes beyond just South Africa. It shines the spotlight on African comedians in general, including South Africans, Zimbabwean, any, any country you can possibly think of, they will appear on this comedy special series and yeah guys that's basically about it these are some of the titles this is just a few of the many local stand-up comedy titles on showmax that i happen to enjoy i hope you will enjoy the ones that i recommended uh, at least even if you just enjoy one of them uh, I, my job would have been done i'd be very happy but yeah that's basically about it guys we're wrapping up the year i hope you had a lovely christmas and as we are heading off to literally seal off this very horrid year i hope you you know go well into the following uh, year and hopefully it's better than what this year was don't forget to subscribe like this video share it with as many people as you possibly can and uh yeah guys that's basically about it and i'll see you in the next video